Is it time to buy or sell TQQQ ETF? In this video, we're diving deep into TQQ. Our initial report was published on our website on Monday, 15th July, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since May 6, 2024, our system has ranked TQQQ as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 2.95. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Those who followed our analysis would have enjoyed an impressive gain of 38.73% since we first listed TQQ as a buy candidate 48 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.81% per day since it was listed as buy candidate. The ETF lies in the middle of a wide and strong rising trend in the short term, and a further rise within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 58.10% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 51.10% and 68.33%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests an 80.21% change over the next 12 months with a potential return between 28.48% and 89.41%. This translates to a price range of $104.38 to $153.88 after a year. Our latest daily update for TQQQ includes the headline, TQQ ETF price up 0.744% on Monday, the TQQQ ETF price gained 0.744% on the last trading day, Monday, 15th of July, 2024, rising from $80.64 to $81.24. During the last trading day, the ETF fluctuated 4.23% from a day low at $80.23 to a day high of $83.62. The price has risen in nine of the last 10 days and is up by 10.05% over the past two weeks. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and in total, 4 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 54 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $4,400,000,000. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of ETF was $85.20, and the lowest price was $30.47. Currently, the price is 4.65%, or $3.96, below the 52-week high, and 57.44%, or $109.64, below the all-time high on January 8, 2021, when the price reached $190.88. The following signals have been identified for TQQQ. The TQQ ETF holds a sell signal from the short-term moving average. At the same time, however, there is a buy signal from the long-term average. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average, there is a general buy signal in the ETF giving a positive forecast for the stock. On further gains, the ETF will meet resistance from the short-term moving average at approximately $81.76. On a fall, the ETF will find some support from the long-term average at approximately $72.75. A breakup through the short-term average will send a buy signal, whereas a breakdown through the long-term average will send a sell signal. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Wednesday, July 10, 2024, and so far it has fallen negative 4.34%.
further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month Moving Average Convergence Divergence, MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving Average Convergence Divergence, Sell Signal, Pivots, Sell Signal 4 Days Ago, Bollinger, Buy Signal 7 Days Ago, Short-Term Moving Average, Sell Signal 4 Days Ago, Long-Term Moving Average, Buy Signal 49 Days Ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 45 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal 50 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 50 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 39 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for TQQQ TQQQ finds support from accumulated volume at $79.35, and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This ETF has average movements during the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the ETF moved $3.39 between high and low, or 4.23%. For the last week, the ETF has had daily average volatility of 4.45%. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for TQQQ. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for TQQ is at $81.63. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, TQQQ encounters its first support level at $79.35. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. Our recommended stop loss is set at $76.69, 5.60% decrease. This exchange traded fund ETF has medium daily movements, posing a moderate level of risk. A sell signal was identified from a pivot top 58 days ago. Is TQQ ETF a good buy? Several short term signals, along with a general good trend, are positive, and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity, as there is a fair chance for TQQ ETF to perform well in the short term. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Tuesday, July 16th, we expect TQQQ to open up 45.7 cents and start trading at $81.70. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the exchange traded fund? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.